Hey, what's good? It seems in the boxing world that Deontay Wilder is turning a lot of heads for some of the stuff that he's been tweeting. People are starting to think that he's not in the right state of mind. But what I read, it isn't even bad tweets. One tweet was just saying that he was tired of traveling. And then another tweet that said that he hasn't slept in five days. Well, that would explain a lot. You feel me? Well, I think personally, if there is something wrong, maybe he just having burnout like normal people do at their job. And considering what his profession is, I think that would be understandable. You get hit in your head all the time. He in the heavyweight division too. He 37, he getting up there. He already done stated that he know he ain't got much time left or he think he ain't got much time left. So I think people are just overreacting, jumping to conclusions, mad because he's saying what he's saying, thinking that he shouldn't be able to complain. He should be blessed and all that because he stated in one other tweet that if people just worried about themselves, that they would have a much better life. It could be a lot. No telling what's going on with him. But to sit here and judge and make assumptions, I don't feel that's fair to the man. But he's supposed to have a fight with Andy Ruiz here in May. That's just hard to happen right now. Y'all know how it goes in the boxing world. But if I was to make a speculation, which I ain't going to speak for the man, but maybe he doesn't want to do that fight. You know he probably still want to fight Anthony Joshua, but they look like that's long gone. As I stated, he's 37. So maybe, just maybe, he really think about calling it quits, which there ain't nothing wrong with that either. But to sit here and question his mental health, I feel that's unfair. Well, that's all I got for right now, man. Y'all be easy and stay safe.